The human race has always been fascinated by the universe, and one of the greatest minds who couldn't resist its allure is Roberta Lynn Bonder. A neurologist, a researcher and an astronaut, the first Canadian woman to travel into space, Roberta Wonder, was born on December 4, 1945, in Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario, Canada. Her parents were of Ukrainian origin from the town of Gorodenka, Ivano-Frankivsk. Both parents encouraged Roberta and her older sister, Barbara, to be color-oriented, and the girls were involved in many activities including girl gates, the umka, and many sporting activities. Roberta was a very inquisitive girl, with a great desire to know more about the outside world. Her parents encouraged her interest in science and created her a laboratory in the basement, where she could develop herself as a future scientist. Being a child, Roberta was thinking about space. She was at the airfield for the first time in early childhood, seeing parents in one of many research trips. Since then, she had a dream to climb up high into the sky. Being a woman of million talents, she made an effort not only to attain her dream, but also to succeed as a scientist, and later on as a photographer and a writer. After high school, Roberta continued her discoveries in the sciences, receiving a Bachelor of Science degree in Zoology and Agriculture from Guelph University in 1968, and then she was awarded a doctorate degree in Neurobiology in 1974 and got a Doctor of Medicine degree from McMaster University in 1977. Eventually, she was admitted as a Fellow of the Royal College of Physicians and Surgeons of Canada in Neurology in 1981. She said that the greatest day of her life was when she received a message about being chosen as a member of the first Canadian astronaut program. Thus, in January 1992, she became the first Canadian woman astronaut. During the eight-day mission, she conducted several life science experiments in Space Lab, focusing on the adaptability of the human nervous system to low gravity and analyzing the effects of microgravity on their living organisms. Her work on space science and weightlessness helped others to understand many things that were unknown to mankind. Bonder left the CSA in September 1992 to devote more of her time to research interests and photography. Her pioneering status as Canada's first woman astronaut and her accomplishments in space medicine brought her numerous awards, including the Order of Canada, the NASA Space Medal, and induction into the Canadian Medical Hall of Fame. She's running her own foundation, which slogan is Infusing Art with Science. Its aim is to help people understand better their environment and how to take artistic photographs and be able to find science within them. Nowadays, she continues inspiring people to follow their dreams, learn and reveal the unknown.